what's up everyone today we're doing just a little quick simple install um, I decided I'm just gonna take it one part at a time because the more I wanted to work on my car then the more I think about all the stuff that I have to install and then I just get overwhelmed and then I just ended up not working on the car so now I'm just gonna take it one thing at a time so I don't know if I'll just make this its own video or I might record over a couple days and then put it all into one video. I think I might do a couple things and just put it into one instead of just making one video um, and not have it be that long. Um, I don't know, maybe, maybe I will, who knows. But today's quick, simple install is, uh, well, I'm gonna show you. All right, from this video, do you guys notice any difference? And if you do notice it, um, pause the video, put it down into the description. Don't cheat. Uh, right now, pause it if you can tell the difference of what I did right now. Never mind, you know what, just put it in the comments if you guys know. But what I did do was I finally installed my JDM taillights. On the driver's side, normal, normal USDM G35 taillight has the red blinker. Now we will make our way to the passenger side. And as you can see, we have an orange amber blinker. And that's the only difference, guys. <laughs> but it's cool, it's unique. And honestly, I think the JDM taillights, I think the red is a little darker than the USDM. I don't know, I think it is. Like going from this view and then going from here. I think the JDM ones are just a little darker, which looks kind of cool. It looks like they kind of have a tint on them. I really think it is, because it's showing it on camera too. I don't know, you guys let me know if it, uh, that definitely looks darker, a darker shade of red than that. But uh, yeah, so install is, it's easy, but kind of a pain in the ass, because there's just little room for stuff. Oh, let me turn this off. Had to get all this, rig this up. Okay. And yes, my trunk is an absolute mess. I still gotta clean this thing out. Still have old work stuff, but let me bring this light over here. So basically, the only thing you have to do to install this is there's a, you gotta take obviously the harness apart from the old tail light, and then there's just three bolts one in there one here, one right there, and then one down in there. And just those three bolts, and it's easy. Pops right out, pop it back in, simple as that. And the fitment on these is pretty good too. It's damn near, you know, what my OEM was, which obviously these taillights are OEMs, so I would imagine the fitment would be pretty good on them. So, I'm gonna do this driver side one now. Get it knocked out of the way, and we'll have both taillights on, so I will be right back. Just like that, we are back together. Everything's buttoned back up. Also, the bolts for the taillights, they are an eight millimeter. And, uh, I am so happy with how they look. I definitely think these are darker than the USDM. This definitely is a darker red. It has some type of tint to them. I don't know, I'm so happy. They look so good. Some people are gonna comment, oh, I don't notice a difference, whatever, but you do. Fitment's pretty nice. I am very happy. <laughs> Could be a little better right here, but I'm so happy. Um, now you're probably wondering, well, what are you gonna do with your stock tail lights? Well, I will be sending those off eventually to get customized. And I'm gonna do something very special. Uh, it is very expensive, but very worth it. And I'm pretty sure I might be the only G35 owner to have this specific style that I'm going for. And uh, so far from my research, I haven't found another one uh, with it. So I'm pretty excited. Uh, I've been talking to a guy who uh, 
who does them. And uh, whenever I get the money, I'm getting them sent to him. So pretty excited about that. Next thing we're doing is gonna install those eBay headlights finally because I'm finally gonna retrofit my OEM projectors. And originally I was gonna do it, but um, it's way out of my league, out of my comfort zone. I'm just gonna send them to, uh, to get them done. So I found a website that I've already picked out, very reasonably priced, and I will be doing that uh, now. So um, I'm done for tonight, but tomorrow we're gonna install those eBay headlights, and I'll take the car outside to get a full view of everything, and we will send those, uh, send the OEM projectors off, and I think they said it'll take four to six weeks for, the, for them to do it, and um, Pretty awesome. I'm gonna do the halos, demon eyes, RGB, everything. Uh, it's gonna be pretty nice. So we'll finally get these customized and uh, we're gonna start moving with this build. So I will see you guys tomorrow when we install those headlights. Guys.